What is going on guys, Apple Advance here, and today I'm going to show you guys how to download your GPA for iOS running on your iOS 9 and on your iOS 10 device without the need of a jailbreak or PC. Now guys, before we actually go into today's tutorial, can you guys make sure to hit that thumbs up button down below. Guys, if you haven't subscribed, go to right now. Also, if you're a part of the notification squad, don't forget to let me know in the comment section below. But anyways guys, without further ado, this has been Apple Advanced, and let's be going today's tutorial. So just turn to the link in the description below and it should take you somewhere right here. Now all I want to do from here is just click get the app. Once you actually click get the app, you should be redirected to your settings application. Now all I want to do from here is just press install, put a password log to your phone. From here, press install, press install more time, and then click done. Now once you get back to your home screen, you should see this app right here installed. Tweetbox, go ahead and open up the Tweetbox app. Now sometimes when you open up, you actually get introduced with an ad, and if, if you do, just go ahead and press the X at the top, and there you go. So once you actually are on the Tweetbox homepage at the top, you'll find three categories, home, apps, and info. Click on the one in the middle that says apps, and then scroll down until you find categories, and from here, find Tweetbox apps. Now, all you want to do from here is just search up GBA for iOS. So, for example, I'm going to search up GBA, click on it, click search, click done, and there you go. I'm going to have, like, GBA for iOS 2.1 as the first search result. So, there you go. Um, once you actually find, you know, the GBA for iOS page, click install app at the bottom right under the icon. Then, click install once you get the prompt for it. Now, once you're back to your home screen, you should have GBA for iOS load up. Now, if it doesn't actually load up for you, that means Apple has unfortunately revoked it. So, all you want to really do, honestly, um, this is your best bet. Turn on my notifications, guys. You won't regret it. And also, just in case you do get it, or maybe um, you turn on my notifications and you happen to get it, please download Dropbox if you haven't already. And once you actually download like GBA Fry West, please sync it with Dropbox because all your saves and everything like that will be exported to Dropbox. And honestly, guys, that is one of the best things about GBA Fry West is that when it gets revoked, it actually saves your save files. Not on GBA Fry West, but I'll actually send them to Dropbox, but you want to make sure you actually have a connection to Wi-Fi when you're actually playing and you can actually sync to it, because if it says sync failed to Dropbox or something like that, that means your latest save was a not sync to Dropbox, so make sure you know your GBA for iOS doesn't get revoked when you're like traveling or something like that, because I know that can be really bad, but basically like somewhere in the link in the description below, it'll lead you to a video on that video and actually explain how to actually download the games and sync your game. So yeah, but if it actually does install for you and you have actually GBA for iOS on your home screen, you'll click on it and it's going to say untrusted enterprise developer. So guys, all you want to do from here is just find your settings application and from settings you want to find general and from general you want to find profile device management. Then once you find profile device management, go ahead and scroll down all the way so you find the enterprise app that belongs to GBA for iOS. So let's go ahead and look for it right now. There we go. This is GBA for iOS's Enterprise Certificate, so let's go ahead and trust it. Trust it over time, and there you go. You have access to GBA for iOS back again, running on your iOS 9 and on your iOS 10 device without the need of a jailbreak or PC. Remember, guys, if you enjoyed the video, don't forget to drop a thumbs down below. But if you haven't subscribed to right now, this has been Apple Advanced, and see you guys. Here we go!